I have great news. I have some really good news. And we can all use some really good news right around now, don't you think? So with you being kind of maybe locked up at home or just spending more time at home than normal, you need something super productive to do. And here's the perfect thing. You have so many photos on your hard drive and now is the best time to edit some of those photos and choose a winner. And here's the good news. We are launching the photographyacademy.com com hope for the future photo contest this is a contest that's running through the month of march now the last contest that we had around six weeks ago was a massive success it we had some incredible photos that were submitted just check out some of these ones that are on the screen right now these are all photos submitted in the last contest but now we're holding it again and the name of this contest is the hope for the future photo contest. We could all use some really nice hope right now. And this is the perfect way to bring up that level of encouragement and hope for the future. It's to see some super encouraging and awesome photos from all around the world. So we are going to have two different types of judging in this photo contest. The first judging will be public voting, and we're calling that the People's Choice Awards. There will be seven different categories of photos that you can submit, such as landscape, cityscape, wildlife, macro. And for the very first time, we're also including a people and portrait category. So there will be seven categories of photos that you can potentially submit into one of those categories and there will be a People's Choice Award for each category. And then in addition to the People's Choice Award, we're going to have the Photography Academy Award for each category. Each category will have a first, second, and third winner in Photography Academy judging. So here's how that will work. There will be three judges, and the judges are Wendy Klein, Wasa Solvi, and Annette Ondheim. They will be our three judges and they will select based on a point score system, a first, second and third place winner for each of the seven categories. So what are they going to be looking for? The judges are going to be looking for number one, composition. Uh, enticing composition, something that really draws the eye of the viewer into the photo and makes the photo interesting through the composition. That's number one. And the second thing they're going to be looking for is emotion and drama in the photo and overall really the wow factor of the photo. So that's how the judging is going to work. There will be the public judging and then there will be the three judges that will assign a point score. So on top of that, we have uh, a few rules. There will be a maximum of one photo per person that you can submit, just one photo. This is a free contest. It doesn't cost anything to submit your photo. Uh, the way that you submit is that somewhere around this video, oops, I just bumped the mic. Somewhere around this video, there's going to be a link. Click on the link. You'll need to enter your email and create a password in order to submit your photo in a secure way. Uh, the judging is going to be blind. And this is really, really important that you follow this one rule here. We don't want any bias uh, from the judges. And uh, the only way to do that is to have blind judging. So that means that you cannot have any watermark on your photo and you cannot have any signature on your photo. So if you do submit one and it's got a signature on it, then we are going to remove it because we want blind judging here. And finally, the prize. What are you going to get if you are one of the many winners? You are going to have your name and your photograph profiled in a video that will be released on YouTube. It will be posted to Facebook and in our Facebook group that has over 7,000 people. And it will also be emailed out to our Photography Academy community, which is now at 75,000 photographers from all around the world. So basically, we're going to make you famous if you are one of the winners. So I hope that you're going to submit. The closing date is March the 31st. Click on the link that's somewhere around this video and submit your one photo photo into one of the seven categories, just one photo for this whole contest. I think that we're going to get some really, really exciting results. I'm going to be reviewing the winning photos. I think there will be in total about 28 photos that will be selected as being one of the winners. So I'm going to be reviewing them and including them as that uh, winner's video. Good luck, everybody. We all need hope for the future. This is one of the ways that you get hope for the future. You start doing stuff that's really fun and it's meaningful and it gives you encouragement. Good luck. See ya.